Oh, hi guys, this is episode four, right? Or three, I don't remember, I'm really bad at For Zoe's and Ruby's birthday. Now I thought of my own idea. It's a bed, this is Ruby's bed. I took her for now over there on the table. And you will need paper towel. And if you don't know how to make a cushion, I can teach you. But I don't know either. Well, whatever. People try, you know. You, we can try. We should try. Someday I know we're gonna feel that way. Just like we did when we were younger. Someday I know we're gonna feel that way. Gonna feel that way like a drum. Like a drum, ooh, ooh, ah, ooh, like a drum. So, if you don't know how to make an origami box, because you'll need one for a LPS bed, um, in my origami origami box with a lid they teach you how to make an origami box okay it's really simple just need a square paper so I'm already had one because it's Ruby's bed it's been Ruby's so I'm just starting off with Ruby's bed let's see how this will end this will end up as so I'm just gonna get like whoops, get like a size well a pen first where's my pen okay found a pen over on this edge and then I'm gonna trace it and then there it is. I'm going to cut it. And then, so it's taking me pretty long because I'm trying to be a bit gentle, you know. People get gentle, okay? So here it is, and I'm going to tuck it in. Um, like that. I felt like I should make more layers so it's more fluffy and thicker. So I did. I just did two layers. So I decided to do two layers only. So yeah. Let's go down done now you will need to cut it again so yeah Done. Like this. And then I put this other layer on the top as well. So it's warm and comfy. Like that. Now, I am going to just cut like the same shape as the bed. But like kind of like this and then kind of fold it in half and then to make the to make it fluffy you could get some 
bad tissue and try and just stuff it in. Like that. It's fine to seal it up together. You will, you might need, you, I use glue stick, simple stuff. Um, I use DIY, um, I always do DIY easy stuff, so you can do everything else, but instead with easy stuff, okay? Okay, let's just kind of stuff this pillow in. Okay, I'm, I'm failing. I'm going to slowly open that. You can, you might not see my crease, but I have a crease a bit in the middle. And uh, I'm just going to glue this. Here, then down on the ends only. There, and then I put my stuffed tissue there, then fold it in half. There. So if uh, if they're not sealed, you could use tape to seal them together properly, or another easy way. You could just do this the easy way. Glue the whole thing. Okay, let's do it. Glue. Glue, but make sure the edges are glued so you can seal them up together. You should be gentle, otherwise, you'll rip it, and I did. So, the problem is that it's ripped, so you can't solve it or anything, you just have to live with it. Unless you want to retry it. And I should. Okay. I'm going to retry it. Because I still have a lot of t paper towel left. So let me just throw that away. I still have loads of scrap tissue that I tried to use with. So let's start again to try the pillow. Okay. Make it like a rectangle shape so your pillow isn't as um as skinny, you know. Okay. Make sure this end is like good size with the bed. So you fold it in half again, and this time I'm going to try to be careful to glue it, because if I fail I'll have to restart again, and I don't want to, I don't want that to happen, so yeah, let's try not that. To try not to make that happen, so I'm going to be gentle with it. Okay, it's really sticky here, but I got some scrap paper, scrap tissue. I'm gonna put this here, fold that in half, and then I just give this a little squeeze on the ends. So yeah, this is how the pillow ended up as, and I quite like it.
So yeah, I'm gonna put the pillow here, and I hope Ruby doesn't know. That's well. See ya. Um, the next episode is me giving it to both of them. So I'm gonna make a Zoe present after. Bye.